Giannis Champions Cup action again this weekend. It's been an interesting block, isn't it? Two games of Champions Cup and then the Premiership, but back to this. Um, yeah. Sale Sharks, tough opponents. Yeah, it's, um, obviously from the outside it seems strange, you know, one competition to the other, but um, at home, well, in the team, you know, it, it stays the same for us. We need to win. So, uh, yeah, well, obviously we, we got a good start with the first two games. And the Sale, Sale team, um, they... They've been up and down, but uh, yeah, we've got a good pack of forwards, physical bunch of forwards. So obviously uh, up front we're going to have to man up. Um, set piece I think is going to be a bit of a challenge, scrumming and um, even breakdowns. I think they, they like with uh, Tom Curry and those guys putting massive pressure on the breakdowns, it's going to be quite a challenge. Yeah. We talked to her when you first arrived that it was going to be a new challenge the Premiership, the Champions yeah. Cup. What have you made of the Champions Cup? It's right up there in terms of intensity. Pretty much everything's there, isn't it? Yeah, well, obviously we're playing different teams from different countries. So, um, yeah, well, uh, each, each week's got a different challenge. But, uh, yeah, each week oh, it's, been, it's been up there. Um, something new. Obviously the French, you expect a little bit more of a physical battle. Uh, Scottish teams a little maybe more tactical so but uh, all of it's been been high intensity and uh, so so far it's been a good challenge yeah when you talk about the French test and that that was probably something new for you and just going overseas and that uh, I imagine with super rugby yeah. you've traveled a lot but yeah just different isn't it yeah so obviously with the super rugby when you travel you travel far like a 12 hour flight to Australia or wherever but uh, over here, yeah, it was quite strange. We leave the day before for France, arrive there, uh, just a little bit of drive to the hotel, and then the next day you leave again. So no, it was quite, it was fun. I enjoyed it, but uh, it's obviously, it's a little bit different, yeah. After the Bristol game, there was a big focus put onto the Champions Cup. Rob talked about maybe one eye was on that, but yeah. the response we've seen in these last three weeks, that's real Exeter Chiefs performances, I think. Yeah, obviously, after the, we were disappointed after the Bristol game, felt we, we had that one in our hands, we let it slip. But uh, yeah, obviously, when you, when you, at the start of competition, you know, you, the, the competition is in your hands, it's what you make of it. So I think the guys just decided, well, we're going to start with, with a new competition, let's nail it from the start. And I think we did well to do that. Yeah. Your aim was to get into that uh, squad, match day squad. Yeah. You've played a lot of game minutes already. You and Jacques yeah. seem to have settled really well. Yeah. How's life been in Exeter for you? Oh, well, so far we've really had a good time in Exeter. We really feel at home. And uh, even with the team, you know, we have friends on and off the field. And that, uh, that really helps a lot. They really make us feel at home. And uh, yeah, we're enjoying it. And in terms of the Champions Cup, if you can bang in another week, uh, win this weekend yeah. against Sale, three from three, you're in a very good position, a very strong position. Yeah, well, I think we'll, we'll take it week by week. Um, uh, obviously, uh, our aim is to win this week, and uh, well, if we get three or three, that'll put us in a really good, good position to um, reach the playoffs this year. Yeah. From a playing perspective, is it weird that you're going to play them one week and then again the next week? Is it, you know? That yeah, that's that also nah, nah, that's also a little bit of a uh, uh, something new for me. So. Uh, We'll see how it goes. Maybe there's something good to it, you know. Um, I don't know how they. Uh, well, to be honest, yeah, I'm, I'm actually looking quite on, uh, forward to see if we keep it the same next week or do we change it up or what happens. So yeah, now I'm looking forward to a different kind of challenge. We spoke beforehand that you know a few guys, or you've come across a few South Africans mm -hmm. in, in sales side. What do, you, yeah. what do you expect from them? What, you know, you would have done some research on them this week. What, what sort yeah. of game does sale come with? Yeah, actually, we did some research, and the guys. Gave me some lip and said, yeah, I'm only mentioning the South African guys. But, uh, yeah, to be honest, obviously, I, you, I've played a few games against all of them. So, you know, you know a little bit more of them. And, uh, yeah, I felt I could share it with the team. And maybe, hopefully, it help, helps us on the weekend, you know, so to, to help tell the other guys what they tend to do and what not. All right.